Hey, once again, YouTube. Uh, in this video, I'm going to show you how to create your own theme for Windows 7, right? So, to start off, you're going to need some wallpapers, and uh, I suggest you go to my video on a uh, cool wallpaper website, and uh, here it is. I'll have the link for the the website in the description. But uh, here's my video, and here, you know, here's the website. So, let's just load it up. There we go. All right, here it is. So let's say I want to create a theme with uh, these a uh, couple of these images. So let me just click on whatever the format I want. So let's just try this one. All right. It takes kind of. Yeah, it takes a while to load up, but you can already right click right here and already save it. Uh, you don't need to go full screen, you know, like, because if you do go, I mean, you know, to the full screen, it's going to be the same size. This is just kind of like a preview. So if you right click, save image as, and wallpapers, and then just name it whatever you want, and save it. Then just go back and get how many images you want. Let's try another one. All right. Um, let's try this one. All right. So here it is. Right click, save image as and yeah whatever save awesome all right so there you have it i'll have the link for this website in the description so then just close this off and then you open whatever uh whichever folder you saved it to in my case images wallpapers all right so to start off i'll use one of them as so just right click and uh put one of them as your background then right click customize you're going to go to the uh, themes part, you know, like the customization part of your computer. Then right here on the bottom, uh, you, you're going to change the uh, background. Just click there, and all these boxes are going to show up. Just uh, click all the boxes you want the background to be in your theme, right? So just click it, you know, you can put as many as you want. So I just want one with these two. Just click those, uh, random order, you know, between them and uh, I want each image to stay as background for three minutes and uh, then just save it there. and uh, here you can change the color of the taskbar to whatever you want so any any color any anything you want let me just leave it like that and uh, save it there you go and uh, as for the sounds I don't mess with that but you can change it you know wherever you want just do whatever you want with it uh, yeah, I don't mess with that. And the screensaver, I don't really use a screensaver, right? So uh, there you have it. Then just right click, save theme. There, and uh, AV, yeah, Alien vs. Predator, and I don't know what the hell this other guy is, the other wallpaper I got, but it doesn't matter. Just save it, whatever you want. Just name it, any name you want. Save it, and uh, there it is. So here are some other themes I created. Um, it's pretty easy to create it yourself, you know. I, I don't see a reason for you to download a theme. I did, you know, the Gears of War 2 one, but it's pretty much the same thing. Sometimes it comes with a few cool sounds that the computer doesn't have, but that's pretty much you know, the only difference. All right, so uh, go ahead uh, and do this, and if it works, well, uh, rate five stars for my video, and if it doesn't, then rate it one, but it should work if you have Windows 7, right? Don't come on uh, hating on me if you don't have Windows 7 and you try it and it doesn't work, right? Of course. So, yeah, thanks for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe, and uh, see you on the next video.